Welcome back to Gator Bites Hacker Summer Camp Vlog for 2024 Part 2 where we go over the Hacker Summer Camp Day 2 for Wednesday morning of B-Sides Las Vegas held at the wonderful Tuscany in Las Vegas, Nevada. Had a few folks coming in to help us get ready for the Dark Net Contest, so gave them a few directions on where to go find our room, got upstairs, and then we started jumping in. Uh, with that, I've got a couple faces blurred here for privacy sake, a couple faces unblurred. It was fantastic being able to see new folks come in and help us out, get things prepped and ready, flashing badges, preparing badges, going through quests and getting things ready to go, which was great. We got to go back to B-Sides Las Vegas for the afternoon. I got a couple talks in, including the Beyond Whack-A-Mole with Vulnerability Management and this awesome SDR talk. Definitely go check it out. I'll have links to these on YouTube. And then it was time to go get in line for LineCon at DEF CON. So this is Wednesday night. Getting from the Tuscany over to the convention center was only about an eight minute drive, even with all the construction that's going on. So that was great. Now there's a huge area that is the Las Vegas Convention Center. So after a while, finally figured out, we're going to the west side of the convention center, which is all of these buildings here to the left. So once you hit Convention Center Drive, you're able to go through and this entire building was dedicated to DEF CON, which was fantastic. Lots of room and having everything underneath one roof was great. Now, this you can see actually some of the signage there, the purple in the background for the DEF CON advertisements. And from here, you also had lots of different parking here on this far side. Now, fun fact here, We've got Bagel Mania, fantastic place to go get breakfast and donuts. And then you have this other thing in the background called Resorts World, where if you were staying there, your room was searched for different hacker tools. So there was actually like a hacker bingo card that you could go through and set up to see if you're a hacker. Moving back to the convention center, this is what it looked like in the evening. Had lots of different setups for the entire area, a couple levels as well. And there was an official app. If you didn't know, you should absolutely go through and install it because it's great. And then for LineCon, you want to make new friends, listen to music, eat, play games, sleep, repeat. And there's so much to go through and do this night. There's not a lot of pictures because we were just there experiencing it. You should definitely go through and do so. Um, this was my bro who was going and doing it for the first time. So Thursday morning, you get your badge, which is great. And this is what the badge looked like if you were a human badge. Amazing. Cool, probably the coolest badge I've ever seen to date going on over 15 years to DEF CON. This is what the human badge looked like when you took it apart, which was a clear case and a pink purplish uh, PCB. And it's in Game Boy emulator based off of the new Raspberry Pi Pico 2. Uh, you did need to make sure that you attached your badge correctly so you wouldn't lose it. And then from there, here's some of the signage that we could see when we were driving in from the inside. It's a gigantic wall. And then this was the dedicated areas where they had sticker walls where you could go through and do. This was early, early Thursday to where the line to go get your swag was pretty long. Then we got to go as the contest runners and go start setting up the contest area. So these are some of the couple pictures that we went through and captured before everything was all set up. Uh, had lots of space, which was fantastic. Uh, we were able to have quite a few people come in and get all set and ready. And I look forward to sharing with you for day three of the Hacker Convention. I hope you like, subscribe, and let me know if you joined us at DEF CON this year or if you plan on doing so in the future. Leave a comment below. Thanks, and we'll see you next time.